Hello, my name is Cheese Nimble, the cheesiest channel in the world, and we the universe. I will be discussing stuff like the whole Toram online server problem and other things like, I don't know, save file theory kind of stuff, you know? And to begin with, how I want to discuss like how RPG MMOs save their database their character database which i've done a bit of research now and getting a little more tech savvy if you think i've been doing some detective work if you mind and so what i've been doing is researching and i've been doing this over a couple days and that is okay with um how character database is saved in mmorpg games i got this from a person who on a website who does who works on M MMORPG themselves well not by themselves but a part of a big group and usually how it's saved is when you're playing all that you accumulate of the of data that's accumulated while you're playing is saved well not saved but is labeled as junk until you get off which then it will take that data run through it and it'll no longer be labeled as junk and put it in its appropriate you know save file but if the game crashes the uh let's just say yeah um you that the those the, that file is that data is gone because the cra system crashed so if anybody played up until the serv the English servers crashed, you probably lost some shit. Next thing I want to discuss was why, or not why, but how, or some yeah, how the servers were taken down, or not taken down, but shut down, or in downtime and stuff like that. Uh, the reason is I've done some research and on March the 2nd, around so a certain time, I'm, I'm not quite sure, on March the 2nd, there was an earthquake near Japan from a picture I've gathered for, it just was the past 24 hours of March the 2nd of 2019, earthquakes, magnitude three and up and there was two near japan one was a four while the other one was a 5.8 magnitude that i remember and i've also researched about hard drives if a hard drive is shaken it can cause data to be corrupt or damaged <clears throat> I don't th sound very enthusiastic right now because I had to do a lot of research in for this. Now, well, not too much, but it's kind of kind of annoyed with the server downtime. Yeah, I hope you're enjoying the the stuff and the content in the background. It was me trying to do a little parkour puzzle, and I'm I'm stuck on this one part here, and so with the with the earthquake it sh it probably shook up or it probably shook the hard drives and it so happened to shake the hard drive that contains english server player database and damaged and corrupt some of the player database though that does it i don't think it's very common for a hard drive to get damaged by shaking, but it is still a possibility. So there's that is a reason. They already clarified that it wasn't hacking or mal ma malware, malicious malware. And my, uh, I have a little theory as well for servers and stuff. People have been saying, like, they've been getting outraged, like, Oh, Japanese servers are still open. Well, it's easy to say that most likely it's because they're different save files. 
each server has their own data character database save files so to draw back on you can go to international everyone can go to international servers yes but not everyone can go to Japan servers or not everyone can go to the English servers and this is because that is our say they <laughs> data character database files save files and to go to Jap the Japan servers you'd have to make a completely new character because you'd have to start from a new and start placing character data into that file so with us because a couple of character database has been corrupted and damaged that caused the english server only to go down i'm pretty sure there's other databases but i'm not quite sure i haven't dug that deep into the researching of how many servers are down but the english one server is down because our save file some of the player database is corrupt within that file this is a theory though but yeah it's what i'm thinking most likely happened i wouldn't be outraged by the by a sobimo i would say that i'm pretty sure they're working as hard as they can to try to fix it and also another thing when they said in their little update thing that if they can't fix some of the data <laughs> character database i'm fucking messing up a lot here then they'll roll back that player's database emphasis on that meaning people who are affected by this only the people who are affected by this to be rolled back to a previous state which was what was it, it was sometime in december the third the third day in december of, two, of 2018 so yeah it's only the people whose data has been corrupt and couldn't be fixed or saved and it is some people just need to read more carefully i'm not saying it's their fault for reading it wrong i'm just saying you got you got to read it a little more carefully sometimes certain things it, yes it could be worded better like those whose data are corrupt will have to be brought back to a later date that's that's just my personal opinion like like whatever it takes to get people to understand better like it could have been under it could have been worded differently for people to understand just i've had that problem where you know you'd read something and you miss something and you misread it and stuff like that you know but this is my thoughts on and theories and stuff that could happen that could have happened and the reasons why this happened or that i'm pretty sure japan asobimo would not delete the english servers and leave us out because in japan japanese people how they look at it money speaks and when they're trying to market to america and english server using people they're a large quantity of people they will bring in more money than most other people in other places so them getting rid of it, it, they would only get rid of something if they're not making money from it. Let's just take Celeste online for instance. Oh boy, I loved it, but most likely it did not do very well in making money. So they kind of just took that down and they, they brought it back, but they didn't bring back an English kind of translated version they just gave us the japanese version and just said here you go you want to just pour some money into that you can and yeah they, they the, it's most like the reason they would do something like that but i literally pour freaking 
money into this like non-stop i'm like take my money shut up and take it so them just getting rid of it for not getting money that's kind of ruled out you can thank people who pay yeah but that that's all i wanted to really discuss about and i hope you guys can understand their working as hard as they can most likely they just working as hard as they can trying to fix it people are like oh they're being sh shady and crap and i'm like you just gotta calm down just step back take a look do your research figure it out why stop listening to people who are just out there saying shit they're just saying stuff just to say it they're there's certain people who will do certain things. Like one of my friends, he sent me a picture and it's like compensation for the downtime. 2,000 orb shards. And at first I was like, oh, that's really good. That's 200 orbs. But later that did I find out I couldn't find that on the official website or anywhere. And that was false. And because someone photoshopped that. And so, you always gotta look out for that. But other than that, I have nothing else to talk about. So, I hope this helped you clear up some things, clear your mind a bit. Just letting out a little bit of that. Just letting that anger go a bit. Just, you know, giving you the clarity, you know. Clarity rose. Now I'm done. Just, no. No, that's terrible. It wasn't even a joke. Just more of a reference of a weapon. But, yeah, just to give you a heads up about this video that's going on right now. It was a video of me and my friend Nub doing a little parkour puzzle and struggling at it. And I thought, well, I've had it saved here for quite a while and I thought, well, I'm just going to save it for a rainy day, you know? I don't really have anything going on. And Taram's freaking down, so I'm going to use it. So I'm using it and uh, it, I think it's pretty interesting and it goes pretty well with, like, just for a short little entertaining thing in the background, nothing much. For what I'm talking about. And. So on and so forth. You know. So I hope. You've enjoyed the video. The video in the background. And. I hope this cleared up some things for you. Again. I sound like a broken record. And I hope you're gonna have. Yeah, I'm hoping you're having a good day. So far. And I caught you in a good mood. And have a good day and goodbye.